Hey, what's happening guys? Dave the Film Junkie here. What's going on? I guess I could say this is the Film Junkie after video show, which I was doing for a while there and then my computer went batshit and now I got a new computer and here we are. Microphone using, of course, the new computer's webcam and uh, here I am just uh, end of the day, tired, just uploaded four videos. Well, I uploaded four all together. When I got home, see, I, <laughs> today was just madness. Okay, but I'll, I'll get to that in a little bit. But uh, you guys got to check out the videos I uploaded because they're all pretty awesome. <laughs> well, they're always awesome, right? Right? <laughs> nah, no, yeah. Toot my own horn there. Cheers to you, by the way. Drinking some cheap uh, piss water. You know, I'd actually grown to like Coors Light. Not going to lie. Um, well, I also had some of this, too. That's pretty good stuff. <laughs> Product placement. Anyways... So, um, yeah, first one I uploaded was uh, new uh, story details for Batman vs. Superman that has to do with Lex Luthor, which, kind of obvious, I kind of was like, when, because what's funny is, <laughs> you know, and I, I respect all the websites that I look at uh, and everything like that, but when they emphasize so much on, like, a twist, like, oh, new story details and a Lex Luthor twist, you know, and then you read what it's about, and then you're like, oh, because at first when I saw that, when I was at work and I saw that people were posting about this, uh, these new story details, and you got a Lex Luthor twist going on, I was like, oh, well, they, maybe it's like a, somebody talked about the different kind of uh, take. And more, even though we already know that he's more like a Mark Zuckerberg, which is crazy because obviously Jesse Eisenberg, but it was just like, you know, he's manipulating Batman and Superman. And I kind of figured, I was like, yeah. I mean, that was kind of obvious. I mean, we knew he was really manipulating Superman. But uh, eh, it's still cool. But uh, there's that one. And then I uploaded two Deadpool videos because there's a whole shit ton of Deadpool that came out today. Apparently, some bar embargo was lifted. So all these sites that went to the that went to the set and asked questions, they uh, released all kinds of stuff. So I have a list of a bunch of shit. Uh, so go check that out. Not to mention that Halloween, uh, that Halloween pick where... Uh, Ryan Reynolds put on the Deadpool costume and posed with a bunch of X-Men kids. <laughs> There's a whole video out now. It's hilarious. It's fucking hilarious. So go check that out too. And then uh, possibly Captain America Civil War Entertainment Weekly issue might be coming out this month. Hopefully. And then, you know, there's a possibility that maybe Tom Holland Spider-Man might be getting, you know, unveiled to us. Who knows? But there you go, guys. So, yeah, first link down below. Just go to my site. It's all there. It's all there for you to check out but uh yeah it's been a pretty long day you know of course i had work um which was you know kind of dragged and then rain came and i was like great because you know i have a commute you know my work's 35 miles away something like that uh and then you got you know southern california traffic it's not that great and i'm going with it so i'm going great and sure enough it took me over an hour to get home and then I had to do laundry, and I don't have a, you know, I don't have my own laundry thing here, so I go to my mom's and do it. Um, but I wasn't gonna do it, but I put it off, and I was like, I gotta do at least one load because I'm like out of like good shirts to wear for work and stuff like that. And uh, so I was doing that, but I also want to spend time with my girlfriend because we're not gonna see each other till Friday. And um, and then it was like, oh man, I got videos and videos, so I'm like, eh, it was just kind of like, whoa, just crazy, it's just craziness, and. Uh, but it's great to uh, finally have my computer back and everything like that. So I feel like I was talking about something else. Man, I'm totally just... Brain just went... Farted a little bit. So I don't... Was I... I don't even really know. But yeah, it's just been... It's been pretty crazy. Uh, pretty crazy today. Um, so I'm just a little tired. But I figured... I was like, you know what? I want to do this again. I want to have this kind of video style i mean like i said in the future i have plans for this channel to not only have vlogs but to take this idea and try to turn it into an actual show show where it's you know there's production value i guess because this, this is just microphone webcam hey look at me so yeah we'll see what happens guys um it's just hard right now because obviously i'm you know working the day job and everything so we'll see what happens we'll see what happens um but go check those out uh, i didn't do a vlog or anything last night i only had one video up which you can go check that out too it's on of course on the site about x-men uh brian singer teased 
that a teaser is coming for X-Men Apocalypse, as well as Wolverine might be involved with all the reshoots that are happening as well. So that's good stuff. Uh, I think there was also uh, Evan Peters talked about Quicksilver again and how he just said, like, X-Men Apocalypse is going to be the best X-Men movie ever, which I wouldn't doubt it. I mean, I would say right now, as it stands, uh, it's hard. X2, I really enjoyed. It's between X2 and X-Men Days of Future Past. It's kind of, man, that's fucking hard, man. It's hard to pick which one I, I prefer. I almost want to lean towards X2, man. There's just, that one was just, it was good. It was good. You know, so I don't know. But Days of Future Past was really good, too. So, first one was great. Of course, Last Stand was, eh. And uh, I liked First Class also. So, but I don't know. I think when it comes to my favorite X-Men movies, it's going to be one of those two. But uh, looking forward to Deadpool especially. I love how they're marketing that with that whole <laughs> thing. It's pretty good. Um, so it's been a Deadpool kind of day and everything. So, yeah. So there you go, guys. Go check all that out. I'm not going to do, like, a long video on this one right now. So but I just want to let you know, hey, back. I'm going to start doing it like this again, most likely. Maybe every now and then I'll just do it like a vlog. I'm sitting on the couch. Because my back's kind of tight, man. I kind of wish I was sitting on the couch. But anyways, guys, so cheers. I appreciate you guys watching. What was that? Oh, I don't know. Weird sounds are coming out of my computer. But, uh, yeah, Peter's up and running full of functional because if you guys watch my vlog, I got the computer on Friday uh, and then audio issues. And it was funny, too, because um, when I got it, I um, you know, took it home and around, you know, and then the audio issues. And then when I took it back on Monday uh, during my lunch break, you know, the Geek Squad people, because I got a Best Buy, they were like, uh, they checked it out and everything. I'm like, watch, the audio's going to work now. And they're going to look at me like a crazy person. And I'm going to be like, no, fuck you. Give me a new shit. Um, but, of course, it didn't work. And then uh, it was being sold cheaper that day. So I got like 108 bucks back, which is awesome, you know. So I got some money back. It was awesome. Anyways, guys, I uh, appreciate you watching. Like I said, for, go to go to filmjunkie.com. Watch all the videos that I uploaded and check them out. Let me know your thoughts about them. Hit that like, thumbs up, subscribe to both channels. I'll talk to you guys later.